Here you go, buddy. You want it? There you go. All right, there we go. Oh, oh my, my cup holder filled up with water. We're gonna try and take a cinematic shot, but never mind. <laughs> okay, we've got our high-end clownfish, and we're legitimately like decreasing in value right now, but we're gonna do it, because it's cool. They have got some stuff going on. This one doesn't look like a Nemo. <laughs> Yeah, that's the uh, the maroon clown. It's so the it's, it's the high end. Girl, a lot more aggressive. No, this is a mean clown. <laughs> mean, mean, mean. <laughs> Okay, so we found the normal clownfish. There's a clip of them, so they're pretty nice, really bright colors. That's kind of like that's kind of what I want. That's just like my sister would love that. My mom, my grandma, like they would really like that because it's like Nemo. It's like I grew up watching Nemo. So I mean, the other clownfish are definitely really cool. If you're into like the really high quality stuff, that's the way to go. But that's not that's just not me. And we should be good to go with our new pair of clownfish. Hopefully, the crowd doesn't eat them because that, that would suck. That would suck a lot. stuff here in a sec. So, these fish are the same as clowns, which we got some shots of. They're actually really, really mean. So apparently, the owner put his hand in here the other day, or like, they'll, they'll like start munch on your hand. There's some clowns in that room too, that are also really mean. But yeah, I didn't know that when I first got a solar tank. Sean didn't express that these things will bite you. And they will. The clown that I, when I pulled him out of the tank today, he bit me like four times. So, yeah, I just wanted to say, like, this is like, this is not the tank to mess with. These fish will, these fish will get you. Oh yeah. Now we are about to eel proof my tank so we can get an eel. Because you gotta make sure that thing cannot get out. Cause they, they are smart. They know how to get out. So yeah, we're getting an eel. Not too bad. So let's do like the brightest, coolest looking orange one. Sure. And then the, all the black and then the black one. <laughs> Excellent plan. These clownfish are dope too, but they gotta be together. Right? No. They don't? No. Don't speckle white all. All the mixes and yeah. coloration differences and all these fancy uh, clownfish, uh -huh. they're all the Ocellaris clownfish. They're all is, capable of, yeah. They're all exactly the same, just color more different, selective breeding. That's all it comes down to. Oh, so what do you think would be cooler? Like one of the black ones or like the black and white? Where it's the your tank. It's what you think is uh -huh. cool. So if we, do, if we do the biggest one with the white body and some speckle on it, that's some uniqueness. Absolutely. And then we've got like the standard, the standard Nemo. Absolutely. So yeah. You want to do that instead yeah. of the black and then the orange? Yeah, let's do it. All right, we'll awesome. do that. <laughs> hey, buddy. There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go. There it is. There we go. Yeah. Awesome. Aww. We got our new clown. Absolutely. That is. Yeah. That also comes with a scraper. Scraper, so I can get that salt that little harder. edge off. Yeah. That would be perfect. Yeah. I was using this contracting razor blade. I was like, I was like, this is a bad idea. <laughs> this is awful. Like, I'm idea. just hammering away at the silicone with a <laughs> razor blade. I was like, I'm pretty sure uh, it's coming apart. <laughs> I think the video should be outside of these guys. Yeah. So I should be able to check it out. You got a fantastic turnaround time. Thank you. I appreciate it. A lot it. of people, we 
sea come in and it takes them a week or so to get something fired off. Yeah, I've got to get something out tonight, so I'm legitimately going to go edit this right now. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Awesome. Cool deal. Thank you. Oh, have a great one. You too. All right. Why can't Petco be as cool as them? Yeah, right? Like, come on. If you guys are in the North Texas area, you gotta go to Aqua Studios because you're missing out. This is the place to be. No, like, I kid you not. These guys always hook it up. They're really, really genuine people, and they've got some high-quality stuff. Every This is, like, the only pet store I try and go to now. But sometimes they're closed early, so it kind of sucks. But that's okay. I will see you guys. Oh, my God. Oh what? My God. What? I can't get my seat. Can get over there. <laughs> Oh, he looks so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Brenton, get your dog, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, lady. Damn. Yes! 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 We beat him! Oh, yeah. Okay, so the tank. It's really dirty right now, and that's because I had to get the clownfish. That involved me moving around all the coral, all that good stuff, so we've kind of got to place everything back where it needs to be. That's step number one. Why do we do that, though? Because these guys got to acclimate for about 45 minutes. We're going to set them in there so they can... L Louis? Mm. Louis. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a new design almost. So we've got this really cool piece of coral that I like a bunch. I don't want to hurt it. This guy came out, and we no longer need him. Oh my god, he buried a whole thing in there. Um, I think it's pretty cool right there. Alright, so, I think the only other thing is what I'd like to do is use this new magnet and scraper. So this little scraper is for kind of the top of the water, which right here, a little salt edge will grow. You kind of hear it coming off. But when there is, you don't you want to get that off. Because the more salt that there is all up in this stuff, the higher the salinity is in your tank. And my salinity is a little high. Not like that high, but it's a little high for sure. So we wanna we wanna work on that. And then I'm also just gonna clean the tank in general. Get it oh god. So I was like, what are you doing? And that's what I'll use to clean the tanks. But for now, I'm gonna turn the light off and I'm going to let everything in here kind of settle and we'll get this fish in or these fish in here in just a little bit. We gotta film for just a second and then Stella can play. Stella needs to eat and drink her water. Louis, don't, don't eat, don't eat. All right. These guys have been in for actually a really long time now. I sat down and started editing this video, but uh, oh hey, these clownfish are so sick. Oh my God. So we've got one authentic Nemo and then like, and these are Ocellaris clownfish. Uh, that's why they're, you can actually, they're, they, they can be like companions or they can, they're not gonna fight with each other and all that good stuff. So I'm super stoked to get them in there. All we gotta do is the same concept. I put this net over this bucket, like so. I grab them, pour them through the net, and then just, you know, boom. Wow. Louis, no, you're not. These are, these are sensitive fish. You can't eat them. These are, we, ju we just acquired them. There's no munching on them right now. Okay, both of them are in there. All right. Oh my God, those are so sick. Okay, so with that being said, roll the B-roll shots. So that is super dope. I absolutely love it. Like I love the new clownfish. We have Nemos. I think they're a lot cooler in this tank and I'm kind of excited to raise them. The other thing I have to do is you guys here coming an eel. So one of the biggest things, so I'm gonna do this every video. I've already asked what y'all's dream saltwater fish. If you guys had to have any color clownfish, what type of clownfish would you have? Or if you had to pick a fish from any movie, like Nemo, Jaws, <laughs> any movie, what type of fish would you pick that you could actually keep in an aquarium? It doesn't have to be realistic, but if you could have any fish from any movie, what would it be? Mine, obviously Nemo, if yours is Dory, it doesn't really matter, but that's what I want y'all to comment down below. Oh, it starts. Watch out, start her up. found out I'm professional and I also ripped up all my grass over there so that's great that's awesome yeah. well hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video let's walk over to the pond real quick there's nose <laughs>
<laughs> the table there. Wow, they really stirred this thing up. Oh my god. But yeah, like I said, if you guys have any videos, ideas, or suggestions, comment them down below. Name the new clownfish. That would be awesome. I have no idea what I'm gonna name them, so I'm gonna leave it up to you guys. So comment down below a new name for the clownfish as well. Really? No, 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 no. No, no, not the pond. With that being said, follow me on Instagram, Media. I don't know if you guys have yet to join the channel. It's a good, it's a good idea. And I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Fanatic. Peace.